Hope you're having a wonderful Wednesday. I'm Fox 23 meteorologist Phil Price. Look at your forecast for today. Tracking sunny and warm conditions. It's going to be warm, but lower humidity is going to make it feel awfully nice. But get ready. The heat is returning, especially as we head into the weekend. We're going to see those summertime temperatures back in the forecast. And unfortunately, no chance of rain, at least not in the next 10 days. We have to get beyond that, maybe towards the latter part of the month before we finally start to see some rain chances. Take a look this morning. Some We'll call it chilly conditions compared to what we've seen. 57 degrees in Bartlesville, 59 up towards Independence, Kansas. So yeah, some of these low-line areas saw those temperatures starting off in the 50s this morning. We're going to say goodbye to those because tomorrow we'll be back into this 60s, close to 70 for the morning lows. And then we'll take a little bit of a dip on Friday and then Saturday, Sunday, you get the idea. It is going to be warm. It's going to be warm this afternoon, but temperatures still about six to seven degrees below the average high for this time of year. We'll call it 88 degrees south winds, lots of sunny skies all across eastern Oklahoma. And as far as humidity levels, we're going to keep them in the muggy. We're not going to be seeing those dew points back up into those 70s. So that's going to feel a little bit better compared to where we were last week. But as we get into the weekend, we will see them creep up a little bit, and that'll add a few degrees to the temperatures. And yeah, here's the, at least into Saturday. Not looking at any chances of rain. That's because the high pressure system starting to get back in control across the southern plain. Storm track has now been pushed well off to the north and to the east. And as we head into the weekend, that ridge, and like the last one, it was more centered across portions of Texas. This is actually going to be a little bit to the north across portions of Kansas. That'll be the center of it. And it's going to be sitting there for a while as we go Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and even into Wednesday of next week. We're going to keep that ridge of high pressure system over much of the central plain states. This afternoon, though, pick out your location. We'll see south winds continuing temperatures into the 80s, warming into those mid to upper 80s this afternoon. So as the kids head out for practice, or if you got some plans this afternoon into the early evening hours, really not looking all that bad by 7 o'clock. We start to see temperatures back into the low 80s in many locations, and by 9, everybody back into, the, yeah, back into the 70s. So feeling awfully nice as we head into the evening hours. It'll be a good evening to sit outside on the back patio if you can. Here we go. Tomorrow we're going to see those temperatures warming back into the 90s. Then we're going to see a little bit of a boundary move through. It's not going to bring any chances of rain, more of a wind shift. That'll bring a little bit drier air on Friday, so that'll keep the temperatures in check and start off in, back into the mid-60s. Then we'll get those south winds back Saturday, Sunday, and yeah, we can always in view here at Fox 23. 100 degrees on Saturday, Sunday, we're going to do it again, and we'll keep those triple-digit heat temperatures into early next week. That's a look at the forecast. Hope you have a great rest of your day.